Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to be showing a much quicker way to change your Fortnite resolution without constantly going in and changing your game files. So the first thing you want to do is add your desired resolution to your monitor through your NVIDIA settings. You also have to do this using the other popular method to change your res. After you add your res, you can either apply it to your monitor or leave it on native like I do, but just make sure you have it saved. In Fortnite, I currently use 1280 by 1024 which is a resolution the monitor already supports, which is why it isn't in my custom resolutions column. This works for both Nvidia and AMD GPUs, so just make sure you have the resolution you want saved. After that, you're going to click the link in the description of this video and download the Fortnite Stretch Resolution tool. I didn't make this tool. All credit goes to Reddit user Blockfade. So while this downloads, you can see it's a pretty safe file, and I've used it before and downloaded it as well, so, and I haven't had any problems with it. After this, you're going to open the download and extract it to your computer using WinRAR, since it's a zip file. So if you don't have WinRAR, I'll leave a link in the description as well, but I'm assuming most people have it already. So right now, it's just extracting to my computer, and I decided to put it in my downloads file, because that's usually just the easiest place to find it. After that, go to wherever you extracted the file. I did my downloads, so just open your downloads and you'll be presented with this screen. This is where you're able to change your res and FPS cap. The res that shows up on your screen will be the current res that you're using in Fortnite. So as you can see, I'm currently on 1280 by 1024 Make sure you don't have Fortnite open, and if you do, make sure you close it while changing your res. So I'll put in 1444 by 1080 to show you guys how it works. For the FPS cap, I have none, but some popular FPS caps are 144, 160, and 240. If you have a 144Hz monitor, make sure your FPS cap is at least 144. I have mine on zero because I don't want to cap my FPS, that's just my preference. After this, just press the button and open up Fortnite with your new stretch res. This method is much quicker once you download everything, as you'll never need to go into the game files again, so if you're someone like Liquid Chap who changes their res every other day, this tool is extremely helpful. Also make sure that your Fortnite user settings are not in read-only mode, especially if you have played in Stretch before. So just follow what I'm doing in the screen right now to take it out of read-only mode. This is just the same thing as the normal way to change your Stretch resolution. You're just going to go to your local app data, user config settings in Fortnite, and then you're just going to change the window user settings and go to properties, take it off, and apply it. And the reason you don't want it in read-only mode is that the program can't actually change your resolution settings if it's in read-only mode. So just make sure that that's changed. If you have any problems, I guarantee that this is the problem. So just make sure you look at this before you actually try to download the file and change your resolution using the new tool. So if this helped, please leave a like and make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you're having any trouble with the file or downloading or anything, just leave a comment and I'll be sure to help you guys out. I hope this video helped you guys and I'll see you in the next one.